deportation, floods in India, an economic meltdown, and miners trapped in Utah. Hi, I'm Heather and welcome to We Show TV. Here's a guy determined to live the American dream. See what Juan Gomez's friends and family are doing in order to avoid his deportation to Colombia. Juan Gomez, his older brother Alex, and his parents were arrested early Wednesday at their Southwest Miami-Dade home. The family had been ordered to return to Colombia back in 2002, but they ignored that order. Today, Juan's friends and teachers met outside of Killian High School to mount a public relations campaign. And Mother Nature strikes again in India. The following video shows the outcome of the monsoon floods, which caused destruction to part of the country. See the story. Across South Asia, this scene is repeated. The devastations claimed hundreds of lives and left millions homeless. This is Bangladesh. It should be fields of rice. Instead, it's a fast-flowing torrent. And here's someone who really takes economics seriously. Trying to explain the possibilities of another economic crash, this guy had a complete meltdown in front of the cameras. Take a look. I have talked to the heads of almost every single one of these firms in the last 72 hours, and he has no idea what it's like out there. None! And Bill Poole has no idea what it's like out there. My people have been in this game for 25 years. And this dramatic report is our last story of the day. In this clip from last week, rescue teams were estimating that it was going to take more than three days to save six Utah miners who are trapped more than 15 feet underground. Officials in Utah say it will take at least three days to reach six miners who are trapped more than 1,500 feet underground. Crews have been working around the clock using whatever means possible to get closer, but have been hampered by dislodged... That's it for today. See you next week here on We Show TV.